Hey everybody, welcome back to another Pokemon Open video. Today I'm back with these new, I say new, technically these are new because Silver Tempest just dropped within the past week of me recording this. Um, these newer boxes called Booster Bundles. Um, I don't know, I've never actually seen them before until now. I don't know if um, maybe they started this in Lost Origins or what. Because um, when I originally saw this box, I just really assumed it was a one of the build and battle boxes. Because that's what I'm used to these looking like, is like the pre-release ones. Um, but no, apparently this is just a small box. Like, I'm sure they just repurposed the Silver Tempest uh, pre-release boxes, the build and battle boxes, because that's exactly what this looks like. It's just six booster backs in each of these um these do retail for 20 25 25 dollars for six packs which is not just you're not really getting a great deal when you buy them this way like like i said i think i did the math and you're saving between 20 cents to two dollars depending on where you're buying your cards if you're buying singles i say if you're buying bulk but like booster boxes is completely different. But if you're like, say, if you're going to buy singles, but you want to buy a bunch of singles, you'll save a few dollars if you buy if you if you find these, you can buy them. Like say, if you find them and you're gonna buy more than six, I would probably say look for them. Uh, like I said, you will save uh, you'll save a little bit. You're not saving just anything astronomically, so it's definitely not something I'd say go out of your way to find. But like I said, you are saving just a little bit. But anyway get to the actual point of all everything and zoom in to what we actually want is to get to the silver tempest because like I've, I've said multiple times i'm behind on all my sets i uh, say behind all my sets i'm really just behind on lost origins and most of pokemon go like i'm completely behind on lost origin mischievous swablu swirlix rotom drippy drippy Energy, Clang, Claydol, Worker, Fampy, Armadillo. Armado. I say Armadillo. I got plenty of Armadillos around here. I don't need them in Pokemon. Um, but yeah. Completely missed Lost Origins. I started out in Pokemon Go and then just kind of fell out again. So, you know, we got plenty to catch up on. Plenty to make videos on like I don't already have a backlog. Sandow, Finnegan, Murkrow, Seldom, Faltog, Energy, Raichu, Toxicroak, Ferrothorn, Emolga. Ooh. Alolan V-Pix. V-Pix. Alolan Bulbix V-Star. If I say it right. That's cool. I actually, I knew one of the pack things was Bulbix. I didn't realize Bulbix had its own card. Um, you figured this would evolve into, you know, the Alolan, Bul Alolan Ninetales, if I can get my words right. What you do, earn energy to colorless tech damage. Is it affected by any effects on your opponent's active Pokemon? During your opponent's next turn, prevent all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks for Pokemon that have an ability. Okay. Attack does 70 damage for each of your opponent's V Pokemon in play. Hmm. You. Cool. Nothing else. Very cool looking card. You. Yeah, I did not know. Did not know Vulpix had a V Star. Uh, but again, I also kind of don't research any of the sets. So I pretty much go into everything blind. Like, even if I see a really cool card, I don't always know what set it's from. Unless I just really am interested. Stonefisk, Snowrunt, Fletchling, Ferrocy, Smeargle, Energy, Croc Rock, Anorith, Meowstic, Smeargle. <coughs> there's the regular little Volfix V. Okay, so that's actually, <laughs> there's your set right there. Okay, that's actually interesting. Not just looking at the card for uh, playing sakes. 
because the first attack is 10 for no energy at all. It's just a free attack. And if your Pokemon's a V card, it's a bonus 50. So if your Pokemon, opponent's Pokemon's a V, and you have this card for no energy at all, you can do 60 damage. I don't know. Like I say, I don't play Pokemon. I don't play the card game. I'm just collecting for the most part. But that seems like, I don't know, seems pretty decent. I'm assuming y'all can hear my cat running around being hyper, as always. Because I had to kick him off the table where I'm recording before I even started. Ralts, Fletching, Dratini, Clink, Stunk, Energy, Arachnid, Arachnid, Stone Jordan, Golbat, Durant, Armado again. So, oh, that's kind of funny. Our two rares that were not these or better were both Armaldos. Arnaldos. Whatever the crap that's name is. It's not Armadillo. Scared Litten. Rufflet. Finnegan. Durant. Emolga. Energy. Braxian. Sigilif. Golbat. Spinarak. And a Metagross Hollow. Yep. Am I even staying in focus half the time? Probably not. Probably not paying the best attention. But I say there's packs to open and messes to be made. Not just by me, but my cat. There's our lovely V marker, V star marker, in our energy spot, so no energy this time. Krogunk, Solus, Zubat. Elgin, Elgin, Fungus, Corrupting Aroma, Slurpuff, Hunchcrow, Professor Lavater, and Talonflame. I should probably stop recording these late at night when I'm tired. Because not only do I have to fight yawning, but actually I have to also use my brain. Which, even when I'm fully awake, is a hard task to pull off. Anyway, on to the next box. Wilmer, Drutini, Thievus, Scared Lightning again, Rough, Energy, Hunch Crow, Raichu looking menacing, Ferrothorn, Primordial Altar, and Cineroar Sleeping. I don't. Like, he's literally just running back and forth on the ground. I don't know if y'all can hear his feet patter off the floor, but I definitely can. Oh. That's so many packs. And there's another V-Star marker. Another sleeping Pokemon. Phoebus, Finnegan, Spinneric, Feldum, Krogonk, Toxcroak, Matang, Toxapeak, Clank, Clink Clank. Yep, full sets. Uh, uh, not sure where my train of thought is. Well, that's a cool Pikachu. That's a Sunflora, since I can't pull this card off uh, without just doing that. This is the first Pikachu I pulled. That's actually really kind of cool. Artwork with a. If I could stay in focus, that'd be great. Pikachu, Dedene, uh, Togodomaru, I think that's what his name is. Noivat, Togodomaru, well, there, Togodomaru, Sandow, Swirlix, Energy, Dracloak, Worker, Sunfloor, Sunkern, Gardevoir. Looks like the first box had all the good stuff. I mean, I got three packs left, so, you know, if I could open them. Y'all can let me know. Nah, after I get this open. Do y'all think these last three packs can catch up to the first box? 
I don't know. If it was anything like my last video I recorded um, with two different sides, the first side won hands down easily. Mischievous, Swablu, Swirlix, Rotom, Energy, Waylord, Ninetales, looking very angry, Claydol, Drip, Dreaky, Emolga, Talonflame. Well, right now, well, lost, not, not lost Origins of Silver Tempest. Silver Tempest is kind of letting me down. I mean, it's been kind of downhill since the first, uh, like, three boxes. Three odd boxes. First three packs. I mean, because, yep. I don't know. I don't know what the pull rates are. They may be a little slightly down from what they used to be with various stars and astral radiance. Dewpider. Pony to rest in the field. Venonat, Ralts, Spinda, Hypno, Archon, Serena, Ooh. Duralodon, VMAX, da, 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 da. Trainer Gallery. I finally did look up that. It's not a character card, it's the Trainer Gallery is what they're called. Um, subset of 30 cards in like each of these boxes now. So that's actually. Very shiny. Very cool. And our last one. Couple. Okay, well, yeah, I was not even going to try to say the name because it doesn't matter. Because we're all more interested in the Duralodon looking. It's got a little bit of texture to it. Nah. Uh, uh, Whew. I just try to fight over yawning. Well, I say the second pass, second box has at least given us something. Uh, which I don't know how often the trainer gallery cards are pulled. I don't know. I don't know what the pull rate on this is at all. So I don't know why I'm saying anything. I don't know. I used to, used to. It seemed with brilliant stars and astral radiance, you used to get a character. Not your character card, a trainer gallery card, a lot. Um, so I don't know. I'd have to actually open a lot more of these to see. Baltoy, Suncurrent, Fampy, Ndidi, Marini, Energy, Dragonair, Donphan, Duocean, Esper, uh, Knitted, whatever I'm trying to say, Crocheted. Is that a crochet? I forget. But anyway, last pack, last card is a Kasuian Bravery. So, 12 packs, 4 pulls. Our lovely, uh, yep, Metagross Hollow, our Duralo Don VMAX Trainer Gallery card. This is Trainer Gallery 30, yeah, 30 of 30. Our Alolan Vulpix, and then our Alolan Vulpix Feastar. So, good pulls, but I say but. Nothing just outlandish, out crazy. I mean, it's still good. Not to tear down what I got for uh, 12 packs, 4 cards. But anyway, back to what I was trying to say. I say the booster bundles. Uh, if I can even hold up my hand. These little things, again, $25. You get 6 packs. I mean, like I said, if you're going to buy a bunch of these, I think they're pretty decent for what they are. Um, like I said, you save a few bucks, plus you just get a nice little box. You can you have a nice little uh, deck box now. You can put all your stuff back in. You can hold a lot. Yep. Yeah. I say minus four cards, that whole box just held everything I opened up. So, yeah. But I guess that's the whole point. If you don't want to buy an actual nice deck box, but you want a deck box, you can get something like this. Like I say, you can buy it. And I say, especially if it's your favorite set, you can go ahead. So you get a deck box out of it with Lugia on it. Lugia is just awesome. But anyway, enough of my rambling, enough of my stupidity. Um, I hope you have a good day and night whenever y'all watching this. Uh, thank you for sticking around for my craziness, and uh, I will see y'all next time.